Chris Yan is one of the newest film stars here in Hong Kong. Her movie Black Rose opened number one at the box office. Congratulations, Chris. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Let, let me tell people at home, you grew up, let me get out of your light too, you grew up <laughs> in Boston. Yes, I did. How long did you live there? Um, well, I've been there since I was 10 months old, 20-something uh, years now. My family's still there. You went to Boston College. College. How old were you when you started training in the martial arts? Since I was four. Who, who was your teacher? My mother. <laughs> when you say my mother, it's not just like she taught you in the backyard. Your mother is a master. Yes, she is. She's an international master of the arts, and she has a school in Boston. Basically, that's where we trained every day after school. So was there ever a doubt, Chris, that this was the line of work that you would pursue? Actually, I never thought about getting into acting. I just kind of fell into this project by chance. I started out in film production and happened to be in Hong Kong at the time, and the producer, Carl Chang, was looking for someone to play this role. And my brother is actually the director of this film, Donnie which, Yen. So which a little nepotism never hurt anybody. <laughs> so, well, it kind of just fell together, and I happened to be in Hong Kong. They asked me if I'd be interested. And I'm like, sure, why not? I'm going to talk about exciting. the movie more in a second, but okay. tell me what it was like moving back here for you. Um, actually, it was really exciting. I've been traveling a lot in the past few years. I've been living in and out of LA for two or three years now and I never thought about living in Hong Kong. I was just going to come back here, work on a film project for a few weeks but somehow I ended up uh, getting a place here on my own and then I fell into this project working in front of the camera and here I am now. Most of the movies made here in Hong Kong, do they have some kung fu element to them or there are a lot of, is there a wide the variety? There are a lot of wide varieties but almost a lot of the films do have that kung fu element. It's very prominent in Hong Kong movies. And why do you think it's caught on so much in the United States? Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon was a big hit in the States. Mm -hmm. Of course, the Matrix movies have a lot of Kung Fu. And by the way, I was told Kung Fu does not necessarily mean only martial arts. It can kind of mean having a talent in a lot of different areas right. or mastering different skills. In many arts, in yeah. many variety of arts. Why do you think, though, Americans have taken to it so much recently? Well, actually, I think martial arts has always had a worldwide appeal. And, you know, Kung Fu films in general are just a lot of fun to watch. You know, they have a lot of, like, great physical energy, physical stunts, and it gives women a chance to kick some butt. Yeah, exactly. You know, like that. <laughs> and, I, and actually, I want to show a, a little bit of B-roll from, from the movie Black Rose because you do get to kick a little you-know-what. I mean, some of the fight scenes are amazing. How long did it take to prepare for them? Actually, I had about two weeks' notice. I was told that I'll be fighting a lot with the nunchucks. So um, to get myself prepped up, I thought, well, who better to emulate than Bruce Lee himself? So I started watching some of his old films, particularly um, Game of Death. This is one scene with him and Dan Inosanto doing the nunchucks simultaneously. So I started studying those moves, but you know, Bruce Lee is like amazingly fast. So I had to like super slow mo everything well, just to watch. You're pretty through. fast yourself, and I think you're hiding something there. Uh, Let me yeah, step, out out way and, step out of the why way. Why don't you give me a little quick demonstration? Here. All right. Okay. Yeah, Matt, I think you better try. It's kind of fun. <laughs> I would rather jump in that water you than ready? try this. You just keep going. Are you coming to Hollywood soon or are you going to stay here in Hong Kong? Oh, well, I'm always open to new challenges. Hollywood comes calling. I'm there. Chris Yen. Good luck. Congratulations on Black Rose. It's a pleasure to see you. All right, let me back in here for a second. We're back in a moment right after these messages. Thanks, Chris.